And we're back at Huff Hall fighting Illini Volleyball. The Illini fall to the second-ranked team of the country, Minnesota, three sets to none. Joining me now, Illinois head coach Kevin Hambly. And coach, I had Brandy Donnelly up as our uh, player of the you match. Uh, you know, it was yeah. a rough weekend. We, we, got, we lost six sets in two nights, but Brandy Donnelly never lost heart, never lost fight, and was uh, a lot of the reason we hung around in some of those sets. She was flinging herself all over the hardwood at Huff. We, we put her in every position we could to try to make plays, and she, she scrapped and she fought, and I thought she was inspiring as far as how she, how she defended, and she gave us a chance and sets. We just couldn't sustain the level that they were playing at and gave them too many points, to be honest. I mean, just kept giving them points, so that was frustrating. It was a frustrating night. It's been a frustrating weekend. I mean, they're two really good teams, and you can't, you have to play great to beat those teams, and you know, we're not playing great, and we're, we're struggling with confidence, and we got to work our way through that a little bit. My first chance to see Minnesota this year, and uh, really, I, I, I take nothing away from their setter. I think she's a pretty good setter. But the ability of their hitters to adjust yeah. to even what are less than uh, perfect sets is one of the things that impressed me about their offense tonight. Yeah, they, they run it. I mean, they run it really fast, yeah. and I think they do it so much they get pretty good at moving, and seeing it, and judging the set, and then making the proper adjustment. The proper adjustment. Um, yeah, they're one of the best at running offense and running tempo in the country. I, I, I um, I'm impressed with their tempo. It puts a lot of pressure on you, and I'm really impressed with the, the ball. The, how many balls they hit in bounds just on balls that aren't great sets, like you were saying, especially on the slide. A lot of times that goes bad, and they do extend rallies and give us a chance, or give them a chance to win a point. We had one ace and one error. Does that number, I, you yeah, know, I want I, you, more. you've oftentimes said we don't miss enough serves. Is, is that the case yeah, tonight, yeah. or is it just the case that they're such a good passing team? Or to, cause yeah, they're, good, they're a good passing team. Um, sorry, Dave, I know you're yeah, just ready to answer the question. I'm sorry that I'm on that. But we, we wanted to get to their front row pass hitters because that go was so fast. We, had to, we wanted to back them up and slow that down a little bit. So we ended up serving a lot of balls right at them, which – they still pass a lot of balls off the net. I thought we gave ourselves a chance, but they just didn't get aced. So we weren't going for seams, weren't trying to drop it. We just knew that if we didn't get them to slow down oh, a little bit. Uh, to slow down their approach. Or, yeah, uh, the whole tempo of the change, set. Right, right. Yeah, which it worked. I thought we, it gave us chances. I, I mean, we, we defended okay at times tonight, we just, we, but we, we made more serves. I would like to miss a couple, maybe be more, a little bit more aggressive, maybe get one, more, one, more, one or two more aces in there. But for the most part, I actually like the way we serve tonight as far as trying to execute a game plan and defend. And, and they are a good passing team. I think um, their numbers weren't as good as Wisconsin last night, uh, and I think because we did a nice job. But um, certainly, in general, I'd like more misses and more aces. I think maybe the best set we played was the third set tonight, and I'm yeah. encouraged by that, that this team just didn't fold up their tents after, uh, you know, uh, falling uh, in, in a big hole early. I mean, we led two to nothing, and after that, uh, Minnesota really took control. They did, and, and we played anxious, and we Two nothing in the errors. first set, right, is right, what right. I'm saying. Yeah, no, I know what you meant. And then they made a big run, and then we had to fight back, and that's been the M.O. here in the last four matches, that we're fighting back in sets, and... We just we got to maintain our focus and we got to execute and we got to attack the court and just too much of that going on too many, too many errors going on right now. All right, coach. But as we said in the pregame, uh, still a lot of volleyball left to be played for yes. this Illinois team. So uh, still a lot of opportunity out there. We've got to take what we can from this weekend and uh, uh, another big weekend with Maryland and Ohio State coming into Huff Hall yeah. uh, next Friday and Saturday. Two teams that are below us in the conference. We got to get some W's here. I mean, I think we get these two and then. We get Rutgers, and those three are big. We need to, we need to take care of business in those three. Obviously, we go one at a time. That's yep. Maryland. But, um, yeah, we got some winnable matches that we need to take care of. It would be good to get on the winning side here. Appreciate it, Coach. Thanks, Dave.